as they close out the season series. They play the Flames tonight. They're in Winnipeg on Thursday. And then we wait to see when they open. Who are they open against? Up the left wing, Brock Besser's in the Calgary zone. Besser looking across, feeds back to the blue line. Lindholm, long wrist shot, swallowed up by Jacob Markstrom. Checked by Braden Pahal. Lafferty keeps digging for the puck, then he tripped Pahal. Play goes on, puck kept in by Zadorov. Long shot, blocker saved by Markstrom. What a first half of the year he had offensive memory. He had an 11-game point streak to one yeah. point. Here's Hoaglander feeding back to Hughes, who also had one of those. Now, Verona Glock shot, right pad saved by Marks. In the middle for Zarek, up the left wing, Hunt, all the way across. Huberto on the back, and put that one off the top of the mask of Demko, I think, and the puck goes out of play in the far corner. Stifled dry saddle the whole night. Here's Uyghur head to Sharon Govich, who tips the puck into the back of his own. Thrown hard to the crease, knocked away by Demko, who was positioned well to make sure that didn't reflect the other one. Now McKay to the other end of the ice, knocked down. Puck kept in, though, by Hughes into the corner for Hoagland. He spins his way up the boards, dishes back neatly. Heronic long shot, tipped by Pedersen, and stopped by Jacob March. Practice, practice, uh, details, and, man, when he has to kind of freelance, he's still able to explode across and make big stops. Rasmus Anderson is there. Feeds one down, Backlund curls back to the blue line. Dishes left point, Shillington with a shot. Demko swallows that one up. Checked by McCann, but able to chip the puck off the boards. Couldn't get it past Hoaglander. Niels Hoaglander. Here's McCann, who's right back in her stop rebound. He jams away, and marks from the goal line stand. Keep the play alive, and then this cute little pass through the skates, and McCann just couldn't get it past or through Markstrom. Stuck on the backhand, tried to surprise him, sweep it underneath him, and instead... Force behind the goal, feeds back to Hughes. Turning in the blue line, gets away from Hospicer. Quinn Hughes cuts down, centers the puck, Suter stop, and again. Hughes Suter with a redirect. And then Flames power play moves ahead. Puck drop back, Kadri makes a move to get in over the line. Leaves for Huber to, into the middle. Kuzmenko shoots off the post, beat Demko glove side. Demko out of his net, sends it around and hit Lindholm who feeds to the middle. Here's Teddy Bluger has a couple of shorthanded goals this year, sends it across, Tyler Myers in, scores! Tyler Myers now has two shorthanded goals this year. Nice awareness here by Bluger, holds it. All eyes are on him, and Tyler Myers just took off up the right wing. One stick handle, and then pumps it past the blocker of Markstrom. I was surprised that Myers was going to fire it from there. He had room to go in a little bit further. But puck comes free to McCann. Delays before feeding Pedersen, who steps around Mangiapane and brings the puck to center. Goes against the grain to McCann. Billy McCann across. Pedersen centers, and Poland scores! A dream season for Niels Hoaglander continues. Let's make this look easy. Through the neutral zone, pass across. And going to the net is Hoaglander. He saw that Markstrom looked like it was going to be a shot from Pedersen. Instead, it's a pass and an empty net to put the puck into. Late on the back check by the Flames and the Canucks. Back into flame zone, six minutes remaining here in the first period. Garland gets it to Lindholm, whose quick shot is stopped by Jacob Marchstrom. And here's Nazem Kadri. Gets a return pass from Pospisil. Kadri over the bank of the line. Gets around Myers with a quick shot, and Demko able to make the save. Jacob Markstrom completely on the wrong side of the net. He was sliding left and watched it go wide to his right. Now Huberto at the other end, 2-1 on goal, and Demko able to make the save. Here's Kadri. Ahead for Pospisil. Drop pass to Nazem Kadri cutting towards the goal. Put it on the forehand, and he's stopped by Thatcher Demko. Teams at full strength to the start period number two. He was on the ice with his usual partner, Philip Heronik. Able to bank the puck down into the Calgary zone. Zeri feeds one behind for Hunts. Trying to poke the puck to Huberto. Canucks break it up. Garland out to center. They're two on one. Joshua with Lindholm. Dakota Joshua cutting it on Willie shoots, he scores! Goal number 
18 for number 81. And the Canucks are into a 3 0 lead. Nice work by Garland to get that loose puck to speed with Joshua. And he's on his forehand, so he can have a pass or shoot. And it is in the same spot almost as Tyler Myers. Blocker side, this one's a little bit higher. Now it's Miramanov again. Puck thrown in front. Pospisil robbed by Demko with the right pack. He lost his goal stick, but he didn't quit. And Demko moving to his right made his best save of the game thus far. Stretching across, eschewing the goal stick. I think it's, uh, that's exactly what he wanted to do, too. He's hurrying himself up to try to get it behind everybody. Here's Bluger. Cops have too many skaters out there. They've got six skaters on the ice. They still have six skaters on the ice. He they got away with it. Pospisil dumps one ahead. Rooney. Sharp angle shot hit the outside of the post. Making his return after a 14-game absence following his injury against the Winnipeg Jets on March the 9th. And the Canucks actually being outshot 24-22 through two periods. Lindholm can't clear it out. Shillington again. Dishes down. Puck thrown in front. Tipped on goal and Demko with the left pad. Wonderful save there in tight off Andre Kuzmenko. Seeing some different line combinations from the absence of Connor Garland. And Puck oh, the puck up through and dug off the line by Hughes. Unlucky number 13. It doesn't go past as... Hughes was right there, goes off the post, was sitting there, and he gets that out of trouble just in time. Showing it in building as well, and the crowds get a return feed, but chipped over his stick, and out comes Holdlander. Three Canucks on this rush. Nils Holdlander in front. Joshua! Stop! Rebound! Holdlander couldn't put it home. And they almost had a fourth. Dakota Joshua denied his second of the game. He goes off the boards, off the stick of Huberto, right to Pot Coles, and he moves it. Vasily Pot Coles and takes the puck behind the net, out the near side. Now turns towards the goal with a shot that hit the outside of the post. Puck is loose in the crease. Pot Coles and upended as he went after. Luger tried to feed it back to Susie, but that's intercepted by Hunt. He's through center with a pass to Zeri. Back to Dryden Hunt. Across, and Huberto couldn't reach the feed. Now he gets a pass in front. Hunt, club save by Demko. We're into the second half of the third period. Kadri able to maintain possession as he moved over the banker of Blue Lynch. Susi lost his stick. He retrieves it as the pass comes across. Bahal with a shot. He scores. Don't know if that went straight through. If it did, it's the second career goal for Braden Pahal. And the Flames are on the board. Susi loses his stick. It gets caught up in possible skate. And as he skates over, then there's an outnumbering situation at the front of the net. But it's the screen. Mahal's got his head up. This goes right through and over the glove of Demko. The Flames on the board. The Winnipeg Jets. Flames on the board looking for more and Demko had to make a good save there on Pospisil. Now another one as he stayed with it. He waits for the Flames change to be completed. Here's Calgary's goal scorer, Pahal. To Kadri. Poke check by Suter. Here's Miller. In on Markstrom scores! He's on the board now. The point streaks up to 11 as JT Miller makes a 4 1. He was setting up for this shot you're going to see. Looking glove and then forcing it near side, blocker side. Good job by Suter to get his stick down and create that loose puck. And you see Miller. Canucks on the power play to close out the game. Or oh, maybe not. Miller's in again, looking for number two. Kicked out by Markstrom. Garland. Miller couldn't take it cleanly. And that's going to do it. As the Canucks pick up win number 